going to be able to say that I don't have to poop right now. Just keeping it real, real, real with you. I am running behind. I always am. I need to charge you right now, too. Um, before, I already went ahead and I already have, like, my skincare on, my uh, primer on. Speaking of, I need to take my allergy pill right now. I already did my bed. I already made my coffee. So, right here, I have my coffee and I have my muffin. A blueberry muffin but i want to go ahead and because i forgot i need to pay the water bill new users registered users you already have my password saved so i'm gonna pay this real freaking quick excuse me log on um there you go let me see how much how much how much how much 9121 make a payment oh i know it was I need to pay, 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 pay. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. I need to pay that, and then I want to show you guys. So yesterday I came across uh, base. I think that's what it's called again. Remember, this is the that bag right there. That one is from base, and I love it so freaking much. But with the new job, and they saw like their workspace, there's no way like that would fit somewhere. I need that, but then like I just don't need a big bag like that for where I'm gonna be working. So I saw that they have a backpack that I actually really, really like. It has a spot for the laptop, and it just makes it it's customized for like traveling and specifically when you're gonna travel with your laptop and stuff like that. So I was like, oh, I need it. I need it. I one of my nails broke and I don't even know how to type. Like it feels weird. Uh Ashley M Ah, uh, my freaking allergies right now are in a whole other level. Not now. Just please wait. That scared me. I was like, what happened? Was good, Sade. Let's see how this coffee tastes. It's good, Sade. Mmm. Oh my god, that's so good. So freaking good. Let me show you the backpack. I already have it on my checkout here. So. This backpack, they have it in green. They also have it in beige and in black. Don't get me wrong. The black one is very beautiful. Normally, I would get it. But the green one is on sale for $10 off. Not only that, but I actually kind of like the green one. So let me show you real quickly. So this is what it looks like in the back. And then, like, this is for, like, uh, what's it call it? <laughs> if you're going to be traveling, like, it's really good. You can just do this, which is really dope. The inside, this is what it looks like. So you can put like your cables here. That way they're not just like loose everywhere. I can probably put my agenda here. And in the back, they have another zipper where it belongs for your laptop that's padded. So I feel like that's the reason why I like it. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, buy it. Because why not? Why not? All right, I'm going to let you go because I need to get ready for work. And I um, technically, I go in at work to apply to coupons. I go into work at 1.30, but I have my nail appointment at 9, so it's 7.31. I want to leave my house by like 8.30 the latest to give me the 30 minutes to get to my nail appointment. And I have to put a little bit of gas just to be safe. So, um, yeah, I need to go. I am ready to go. Something very simple, nothing too crazy. I'm wearing all black today, pretty casual. You can wear some shoes like this. So, uh, let's go, let's go, let's go. So I did not get a chance to put gas in my car. Like I have it <clears throat> a quarter to empty, I guess. Like is that, how, is that how you say it? I don't know the terminology for this kind of stuff, but I have enough gas to like go to my friend's house and possibly to get to work, but tengo el pinche gallo torado. Um what's it called it? Depending what time I get out of there, which I'm hoping I get out of there on time. My girl got a Speedy Gonzalez this set. I literally will be with her for three hours, so hopefully within those three hours, like, she can get my nails done. <clears throat> and then I'll have an hour and a half to get to work, so I feel like that should give me more than enough time to, like, stop and get gas around that area where she lives. It's not too far away from my house. So, um, yeah. We'll figure that situation out. Pero, you guys... 
this is gonna be TMI, but it's gonna be funny at the same time. So, tell me why I was like sexting a guy yesterday. And I didn't even start it, but I was entertaining it, I guess. And I wasn't even really saying much. I was just basically listening to everything that this person was saying. And <laughs> I don't know if I'm the only one, but like I find that kind of stuff kind of funny. And like I was sharing it to my friends. And they were all like, ooh, you better have him send you the D, girl. Send you the D. Send the receipts, you know? So then, um, he basically was saying that he wanted to make me you know what with his mouth and his you know what. And then I was like, mmm, this is the perfect time. I was like, let me see it. Let me see it. <clears throat> but this whole time, I'm like red. I'm so flushed. Like, I'm so just like embarrassed at the same time. And I was Police like, reported ahead. Okay, bitch. <clears throat> that shit scared me. I was like telling Rafi, like, how do you casually sex people? Because like, this is too much for me. <clears throat> well, the guy ends up sending a video. And this is all through like DMs, okay? So I was like, oh my god, like, I'm so scared of like screenshotting it. And he's going to know that I screenshotted it. But thankfully, he did not. Like, I was able to uh, record it and send it to my friends. So that, you know, I showed them the receipts. Girl! Want no short dick man. Don't want no short dick man. Don't want no short dick man. I don't want to get copyrighted, but I mean, why do I attract these men? All the men that have sexed me have all. And listen, I'm no one to judge. Like, I was even telling my best friend, right? And she's like, why does size matter, right? And then I was like, bitch, I'm fat. I would like to feel something instead of just pressure. Unless I'm mistaken, and that's all that it feels like. I'm not that experienced, but what I'm saying is that I wanna feel something. You know what I mean? So, I was like, wow. Just wow. I guess I'm gonna start asking for receipts with all the men so that I know what I'm getting myself into and then I'm not like disappointed when I see them in person and then like it's just not what I wanted. You know what I'm saying? Like I need a level love. Not saying that I want the biggest D in the world, but you know, a little bit above average would be nice for my fat ass. Wow. That actually scared me. All right, well, I'm almost to my nail appointment. These are, right now, the nails that I'm working with. This one broke last night, so I'm glad that I have my appointment this morning. You know what's funny, too, is that I started doing what my friend does. So I have, um, there's these two, for example, two guys that, I sound like a player, but I swear I'm not. You just have to keep your options open because I learned that. I got no title, I'm still single. I can still talk to people. Why am I going to put my eggs in one basket? First of all, where's my exit? Manchester. All right. Um, I do not save their numbers. Because most of the time, they end up like, bye. So why should I save your number? Anyways, I'll let you go. I'll talk to you guys. When I'm out of my nail appointment, I'll show you guys what I'm going to end up getting. I'm going to go shorter. Like, really short I mean like these are pretty long I thought they were short but like they're kind of long and since I'm gonna be typing a lot more and I want to make sure that I can you know be like fast and whatnot I want to get them a little short so uh, yeah we'll see what I end up getting that's my freaking the noise in the background is my my fucking Bluetooth thing okay anyways I'll talk to you guys when I'm out of my appointment. The only frustrating thing that I like dislike about having to come get my nails done, like, is the fact that I can never like find parking. It's just like one of my like I like I'm so frustrated I'm gonna cry because I fucking hate struggling. Like I just hate struggling when it's something that can be simplified, you know? I love her work, she works from home, I will still continue to come, 
but I will always bitch at the fact that I can never find parking. I've been fucking going in circles. Like, yes, there is some, like, here people, okay, first of all, you're at fucking work, so why should someone be holding a spot for you? Like, all these cars are parked halfway, and I can't fit anywhere. And then the, it's just, I hate pearl parking. I fucking hate it. And then especially if I don't have enough room, like, I'm not going to be a fucking boss bitch trying to, like, fit somewhere and then get hit or, like, hit somebody, you know? <sighs> it's just, like, so fucking annoying and frustrating that I can't find parking. I've been going around in fucking circles for literally 10 minutes. I don't know where the fuck to park. I'm gonna go in here, see if I can find some parking. I think I, no, I don't think that was parking over here. Oh, is this a fucking parking? Well, I'm gonna fucking take it. I'm telling you guys I hate pro parking. I suck at pro parking, like, bad. My heart is racing. Somehow I managed though, which is very not like me. Alrighty, should be fine. <sighs> Only fucking forever now. Right, let's go walk. Bye. So I am on my way to my job. And it says that I'm actually going to get there. It's 11.36 right now. It says I'm going to get there around 12.16. So we are good in time. I'm taking the streets. It's going to take me about 40 minutes. But that's fine because then I'll be able to kind of see a gas station around here. Because, girl, the gas prices over there in Beverly Hills is out of the world. It's a little much. So, I'll find a gas station on here, but girl, I need to pee. So, I'm thinking, like, should I go to my old job and pee there? Like, I don't want to be that person, but at the same time, like, maybe. I don't know. Um, but that gives me enough time because I have to fill out the paperwork stuff, too. So, yeah, and I'll figure out, like, where I'm going to park and everything. Um, but here is my nails. They're so cute. They are rose gold. I'm obsessed. They're not like extremely short, but they're not long. Like they're good because I'm still able, like I'm able to hold my, like hold my hands well. Close my hands so I'm able to do stuff with them. And I'm going to be so easy to be able to type. And not only that, but my nails needed this break of them being short because I've had them long for a while, so all the pressure that I was putting on the tips of them and everything really Fs up your nails, so. Yeah, my makeup is falling off on my chin, like. Oh, this guy's like, what are they, what are they selling? Food, but like barbecue, I guess? Um, I'm trying to figure out, I don't know if, uh... Like, on my way to work, normally in the freeway, and also like on my way back home from work, uh, I normally pass by the Culver City Mall, and I'm thinking that I might stop there instead because I think they must have like a shoe store, like an Adidas store or like a shoe store that sells Adidas so I can buy the shoes and that way I don't have to go to the store tomorrow instead. Wow, I'm getting a little bit of cramps and I think it's because of the coffee. Woo-wee! My stomach is hurting right now. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, I don't really have much to say for right now. I'm kind of just still like vibing, just like going with the flow, you can say. So I'm about to just bump some music and go to work. So I'll talk to you guys when I get there. So you can help me fill out my paperwork and stuff. I also want to go to the Culver City Mall because I think the Culver City Mall, aside from having shoes, they also have a Sephora. And I noticed that I'm like running really low on my uh, brow pencil and I love the Anastasia Brow Wiz. So I'm thinking about buying like maybe two or three and that way I'm in stock for a little bit. So, because I don't think I have any more. I'll buy two for now. There's actually, oh my gosh. 
I don't have to go to a fucking Sephora because by my job there's a, a Bear, uh, Anastasia Bear with the Hill store, so I'll just go to that, dummy. I wasn't thinking. I hurt my back or something. Pulled a muscle or something. Feel a little uncomfy. But anyways, I'm gonna let you go now because you can overheat very fast because the sun is out and it's shining really close to you. So I will talk to you guys later. So I just parked and uh, I have literally an hour to spare and I have to pee. But I have lots of paperwork to fill out. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. So I'm glad that I have the time to do all of this. Okay, so I'm going to start filling this out, and uh, yeah, alright, I'm a little tired, not going to lie, I haven't really, I mean, all I had was a blueberry muffin, I kind of want to go to Chick-fil-A because I know that they have, let me just turn this off real quick, oh, I have to pee, um, I know that they have, but TikTok. It showed me like the bowl, like so you get the fries and you get the mac and cheese and you get the nuggets and then you get the Chick-fil-A sauce and like supposedly that's a banger. So like I'm craving that. I've been wanting to get that for a couple days. So I might wait to go to Chick-fil-A later today. Who knows? But all I have in my system is cafe. So <laughs> you know how that gets you when you are. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, fill this out. I am done with all the paperwork. This car parked so fucking close to me. I hope there's nobody like trying to park right now. Like, it's gonna be waiting because all I'm gonna do is just like reverse a little bit and get more closer to that way. Because, <laughs> excuse me, sir. Like, this car is literally so close to me. Can you see it? I think you can see it. Uh, this car is way too fucking close to me. Yeah, because fuck. Yeah. Alright, I think it should be fine. Alright, alright. Thankfully, there was, like, enough room for me to move. But my friend texted me saying, were you supposed to be in at 1? And I was like, no, 1.30. And I sent her the message. And she's like, oh, I think she thinks you're late. So then I messaged her and I was like, hey, I know you said 1.30, but I am at the parking structure. Let me know if I can start walking in now. That was like, girl, no, I'm not. <laughs> not late. All right, I'm going to let you go and I'll let you know how everything goes. Hello, hello. I am back. Yo, I'm so oily. It went well. I got all my paperwork done and I don't have to pay for parking. How does this work? Oh, dummy. So I'm just gonna put it on here now. Oh shit. Yay! So that way I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, they gave me my sticker for parking, so on Monday I'm good to go. Um, I did not expect to see the doctor today, so I was actually a little nervous. Not gonna lie, because I was like, normally I don't look like this, you know? Also, I got my brow wiz. So we're good. Right now we're gonna go to the Adidas store. It's in Culver City, actually. So let me put the mall for the Culver City Mall. Let's see. I have to pee. I still haven't peed since I fucking told you guys, Culver. <sighs> Culver City Mall. Which is the Westfield Culver City Mall. Yeah. It's 5.8 miles. It's not far. Now, you know, I have a little bit of a headache, and that's because I haven't ate. I did not get COVID tested. I'll get COVID tested next week. Sometime next week with the whole team. Um, so yes, I saw my wallet here. Yeah, so I saw the doctor 
And honestly, I am so happy that I did because she was honestly, I mean, when I was talking to my, like, I'm going to call her, like, my manager. Let's just call her that, right? Like, my boss manager. When I was talking to her, because we were talking, we were discussing all the paperwork, just, you know, orientation. They discuss, first of all, I'm going to get direct deposit, which is nice. I haven't had that in, like, a very long time. Um, so then that means that I won't have to pay the stupid fee that Chase always gets me because in Chase, as long as, if you don't have a, like, college account or whatever, every month if you have less than $500 in your account, hold on, let me get this shit out. If you have less than $500 in your account, which, you know, it happens, you gotta pay your bills, boo. Then, they charge you like $12 a month. But if you have direct deposit, you don't have to worry about that. Ooh, I need to put my mask on. I thought it was maybe like a machine, kind of like the old parking structure. This is not the parking lot that I'm gonna be parking at. This is a different one. That I will be parking in the right one next week. Thank you, have a good day. I'm gonna put away my card now because <laughs> it happened in the past where I'll go to the store and then I forget that I have my freaking card. All right, time to go. So yes, the doctor was so nice. Um, she made me feel very like at home. Like honestly, everything that I've heard about her I was able to see within like the few minutes that I was around her. She was so polite, so freaking sweet. Said so I need message me. So um what was I saying? Yes. And then she saw that I was like doubled mask and she's like, and you're doubled mask, I love that. And then she looked at the rest of the team to see if they were doing that and they weren't. So I was like, oh please. Team, do not hate me, por favor. Thank you very much. Do not hate me. Uh, I'm gonna have to get used to this. I'm not used to this. All right. And uh, she was like, "I'm so happy to see you on board." Like she was already like talking to me, like like nah. You know, sometimes I just. I was telling my boss, like my manager, I was telling her, you see, when people were asking me, like, how do you feel about, you know, you leaving and stuff, I told them that I couldn't believe it because it's like the job that I'm starting, it seems like too good to be true kind of scenario. And she's like, well, don't get me wrong, she's like, it's not Disney. And I was like, no, I know that. But I think that like, I know that this job is going to be stressful while I'm like doing stuff, like while I'm at work, but the fact that like you get compensated for and they take care of you is what's nice. You know what I mean? I haven't had a job take care of me like that in a very long time. So that's why I think that it's just so like mind blowing. Like she already told me, so like on Monday since you're starting, we're buying lunch for everybody. Like. So I don't even have to worry about bringing lunch on Monday because they're going to take care of me, you know? And she told me, oh, you're going to be here for the Easter bonus. I just started and you're telling me I'm going to have a bonus already? Like, you see what I'm saying? It's like I haven't been treated that way. And I think it's just because obviously it's programmed a little bit different because it's private owned or whatever. But like, I am just kind of like, wow, okay. All right, <laughs> but yeah, it was nice. I was there for two. Whoa, this guy's all that shirt. I don't feel like I've never seen a guy. Oh my god, now I know what girls. Oh my fuck. Wow. Wow. You know, like when you see those models, 
like those guy models like in guess and shit when they're like ripped up and stuff and you're just like wow that looks photoshopped that was a guy photoshopped it was a walking billboard i have i have i've never really like seen that in real life so now i can see what it's all about but i need to get skinny first <laughs> But yeah, everything went well. I was like, yes, I'm excited to start. I already have my scrubs. I am ready. I'm, you know, I'm about to go buy some shoes. Because the only shoes that I have... It's funny because my girl who does my nails, she's like, you're telling me you don't have any shoes? I was like, bitch. I've been working at the salon for three years. All the shoes that I've invested have been in boots, tacones. So, no, I don't. I said I only have one pair and it's already getting, like, worn out. That's why I want to go buy another pair. So I'll show you guys real quick because they're the ones I'm going to put on with my socks when I get off for the mall. These are the only Adidas shoes that I have. Like overall, like really any tennis shoes. These are the only ones that I have, which are fine. They're good, but I know that they're getting worn out. And uh, so I'm going to need some shoes. Is it here? So that's why I'm going to go buy some shoes. This one doesn't say no turn on red. So I should be fine. Okay. You do you, sir. I get nervous now because in Beverly Hills is where I got a ticket for not waiting too long at a red light to like turn right. Like, yeah. Bird, what dare you? He just flew really low. I'm not making that face because of the bird. I'm making that face because I'm trying to figure out, like... You know, sometimes the roads are just so ugly. And they make sound. And then I'm thinking, wait, is it the road or is it my wheels? Like, am I low? <laughs> like, what's good, Sade? Um, yeah. So, I'm just excited to start. My weekend starts now. I think I'm gonna call my brother and be like, hey, I'm gonna buy some Chick-fil-A on my way home. I think. The thing is, I wanna buy Chick-fil-A, but at the same time, like, I don't wanna like eat it at home. It's gonna get cold. So I don't know. I don't know what to do, baby boo. Oh. Is there Chick-fil-A in the... If there's Chick-fil-A inside that freaking mall, you best believe I'm gonna buy it. And I'm gonna eat myself without telling anybody. That's what's gonna happen. Alright, well, I'm gonna let you go because that's the update for now. I'll end up showing you guys what shoes I end up buying. Alright, that's if I end up buying. I mean, it's just that there's an Adidas store in the Culver City. So I'm assuming it would be the one in the mall. So even even if they don't have an Adidas store in the actual mall, there has to be a shoe store that sells Adidas, you know. And you're probably like, actually, why Adidas? I don't know. I know there's Nikes too, but like, I like the idea. Like, I like, I want to buy basically almost the same style. I'll actually show you because I took a picture of the actual style that I want to buy. I think these are really cute and they'll go good with the blue scrubs like these. I think they're so cute. I just don't know if they'll have them in stock, but... I think that those are so cool. So I want to buy those. At least one pair for now. And I'll use the black and the nude. At least one pair. Max two. But at least one pair. And maybe I'll buy some trunkless. Because the pink ones that I have right now are disgusting. The black ones are in my car actually. I'm not even sure if I'll need them anymore. So, the guys at the parking structure, though, where I'm going to be parking, literally, it's underneath my, my where I'm going to be working, so that's nice. I don't have to, like, park and then walk. It's going to be, like, park, elevator, <laughs> direct to my job. Basically, so that's kind of cool. They speak Spanish. So, she introduced me to them, like, hi, I have a new employee, like, she's going to start with us on Monday, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, los miro lunes. And then they realized I spoke Spanish, you know. You know how it goes when they know that you speak Spanish. Like, mm. <laughs> and I was like, got you. <laughs> Don't be talking shit. <laughs> but, yeah. So, apparently, my schedule is going to be 9 to 5, which is kind of nice. I thought maybe she was going to switch it to 10 to 6. But she said sometimes if needed, if they need someone to have coverage at that time, like that late, 
then they'll, sh they'll make me do 10 to 6, but for the majority, she said, it's going to be 9 to 5 unless we say otherwise. <sighs> so that's nice. So you see, everything seems good so far. Yeah, I was going to hang out with Sarai really quickly because she's in this area. She's at the salon, but when I called her, she didn't answer me. And then, well, I can't wait because, like, I have to go to the, you know, mall and stuff and mando miendo. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, so I was like, I'll just see you next week on Saturday. I think that's we're supposed to because our Korean barbecue thing that was supposed to be going on tomorrow is not actually gonna happen. So I rescheduled the dinner thing that I was supposed to have today to Saturday, and that's why I want to go get the shoes right now because I don't want to have to worry about it tomorrow like having to wake up early to go to the freaking mall or whatever. I'm just gonna wake up, get ready, and go get mimosas. That's, that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to film a video tomorrow for my YouTube channel. Channel! For my YouTube channel. I need to plan out all my... Oh, that's the music. I was like, is that my car rechinando or what? It was the music. It was playing very, 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 very lightly. Alright. Well, I'm going to go for real now. I'll see you guys at the store. Okay, bye. So I ended up buying more than uh, than I was going to. First of all, they didn't have the shoes that I wanted. I got myself some pretzels. Because I told you I haven't ate. And I didn't want to eat here. And I didn't want to have to go look for a Chick-fil-A. So, Chick-fil-A. can wait for another day. Let me see. I see it. Love that. Whoa. If you know me. Mm. You know that I love um, lemonade. Alright. First things first. The shoes. I think I'm going to order because I think they have it online. They're not out of stock of it yet. So I think I'm going to order online the shoes that I want. But I ended up getting these because I still needed some. They look basically like the ones that I already have, but it has like a pink. And then I think mine are all, am I not black? Basically, mine have an ombre at the bottom, like where the white is. But I'm going to go ahead and use these. The nude ones they didn't have, like I said. But that's fine. And these were actually, I paid like $65 for those Adidas shoes, but I'm surprised because normally they're like 100 and something, I believe. And then I saw Bath and Body Works and literally I am out of my candles. But I also got some of these like car smelling things as I'm out because I actually have this. It doesn't have anything that's supposed to go on here. So I'll be putting that on later. Oh, I thought I had something there. And then I got, I don't want to unwrap them, but I don't want to show them to you. But I have two candles. I got the mahogany because that's like my favorite. And then they have a mahogany coconut. Just locking my car, just in case. I don't know these people. Um, so I got that, and then I went to the Lush store, and I got myself a bubble bomb. So I'm able to break into pieces and then throw it in there, because uh, I'm going to celebrate, okay? So this weekend, I'm going to go ahead and wash the bathtub and take a nice bath. And then I got a scrub, too. I got the orange one. It's supposed to help brighten and exfoliate. So, uh, that's all the items that I got. I'm going to put this down here because I'm not trying to have it, you know, break on me. I'm going to turn on my car, let it warm up. I'm going to enjoy my pretzel. Excuse me. I got the pretzel that has, oh, she put napkins in here. So funny because I was like, can I have napkins? And she's like, I already gave you some. And I was like, oh. <laughs> she's like, do you want more? And I was like, no, because I thought she gave enough. But girl, two Excuse me, you gave me two napkins? So I have the little, um, like, hot dog things. And then I got the pretzel that has the pepperoni and jalapeno. Mmm. 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 I told you guys I'm freaking hungry. Mm-mm-mm. I'm going to put directions to go home. It's Friday. 
So, traffic is normally bad. I'm gonna take the streets. I think I should be home by like 6. I'm gonna say 6.30 the latest. Alright, I'm gonna go. Cause I'm gonna be stuck in traffic. Why I stuff my face? Why I stuff my face? Normally I get the one that doesn't have jalapeno, but they didn't have any and I didn't want to wait. So, story of my life. Alright guys, I'll see you when I get home. So I already went ahead and washed my face. I am going to go to bed now. I know I'm looking real rough right now, but my acne down here is getting way better now. So that's good. <laughs> I did end up ordering the shoes online. It said it's going to be arriving anywhere from four to eight business days. So we will see about that. There's a lot of stuff that I want to accomplish tomorrow. I am going to be going out to eat and get like a drink with Tatiana tomorrow, like around five. So I have to get a lot of stuff done before then. Um, for sure, not a bath tomorrow, but I'll probably do a bath on Sunday. Tomorrow I want to wash my uniform and then on Sunday I'll do like the other wash stuff. But um, right now I'm going to close the closet because I never sleep with my closet open. Am I like the only one? Let me know. But okay, now that I pointed out my whole like acne down here, I'm like wanting to like, you know, pinch whatever I see. But here's Mr. Ronaldo. He's ready for bed. He's a little naked boy. He doesn't have a shirt on right now. But... We're going to go to bed with that Ronaldito. All right. So thank you guys so much for being with me today. Um, I'm going to call it a night here. And si Dios quiere, nos vemos mañana. Okay. Bye.